Greetings and welcome to another ACB Radio's Blender 2.49b tutorial video. My name is Samueli Winmere Solo, your tutor for this tutorial video. In this video, we'll be making Blender 2.49b Fallout compatible. How exciting, so let's begin. First things first is that we'll need to head over to this Nexus page. Simply copy the title into your favourite search engine. You'll find a link in the description of this video if you're having trouble searching for it. Officially created by ACB Radio, here on this page you'll find all the key necessary programs and instructions to make Blender Fallout compatible. Our first step is to download a program called Python. We'll need to extract the file using a program called 7-Zip. Please refer to the description below if you're a little unsure about 7-Zip. Once Python is extracted, we'll need to run the installer. This one's quite easy as all you'll need to do is accept all defaults and install. Once Python is installed, we'll need to download Blender. Download it from the list provided and extract the file content. Inside the Blender folder, we'll need to run the installer. This one's got a twist to it, meaning a slight change in its installation location. Accept all defaults and proceed until the installer asks you for the installation location. You'll need to change it like so. Once that's done, click next and be sure to change user data to Use Installation Directory. Click next and install Blender. Open up Blender once it's installed for positive reassurance. And so, after you've installed Blender and you know it's working correctly, next we'll need to download PYFFI. Download PYFFI and extract. Once it's extracted, open the installer. There's another alteration in the installation location. Just copy the new installation location from the instructions found on this Nexus page. And so, once we have installed PYFFI, we can move on to Blender NIF Scripts. Download Blender NIF Scripts and extract. We're going to change the documentation location and not the install location. Please make sure to leave the install location by default and just make alterations to the documentation location. That's it! All done, but wait! There's just a little more! NIFScope! Such a wildly common and effective program for most of your modding needs. To install NIFScope, simply download and extract the contents to the Documents folder. And so finally we'll end the video on Microsoft Visual C++ 2008 Runtime. Microsoft Visual C++ 2008 Runtime may or may not be needed. Doesn't hurt to have it though. Thank you so much for watching ACB Radio's Making Blender 2.49B Fallout Compatible Tutorial Video. 
For any and all business inquiries, please feel free to email me at lordsamuelewindmeersolo at gmail.com. And last but not least, please indulge yourselves with these many websites related to ACB Radio. You may find links in the description below. Thanks a million shillings. Bye-bye.